I'm redoing this piece for you. Uh, one part of the video didn't work, so I'm going to load my script liner in milk chocolate, drag it through the honey brown, and I'm going to start like so, following my lines. Now I've just quickly based it onto this piece so you could see. Then I touch my dirty liner into camel and streak a little highlight and I can put a little sand in the middle if I'd like as well. So that's just a little highlight. So my boards of course are not done. So I dip, load in the one, touch into, come from a little angle on there, a little bit of an angle on there. I did not put all of the lines onto the line drawing. I just did these ones so it wouldn't be a little crazy for you. The other ones I show in the video how to go from angle to angle and, and do those cross pieces. It's easier than having all those lines on because it's very confusing. So you're going to do that. You're also going to be coming and doing the ones that come down like so over the, the wood bar sections. So all of the lines that we have transferred on, I had enough on the dirty brush for the highlight and everything on that one. So I'll go back and streak my highlight. So all of these you're going to go ahead and transfer on like that. So it's all the vertical lines you have transferred on and all the horizontal lines. And then this will let you carry on for the rest of the video. Okay, so we've done all of the pieces that are coming down that we transferred on and the ones going sideways. So now I'm going to take my liner, dip into the same colors again. I started with this one. You're going to follow your photo and put the pieces going in the background. And then we will be coming back across. And I will take the camel and put it back on top like we did before as our highlight. Then I'll move on to the next piece. You might notice that every here and there they don't cross over each other. This diagram down here, I didn't do the crossover. It's not going to matter if you do. You may as well go ahead and cross it like the rest of them. All right, so you're just going to follow your picture and carry on crossing your lines. So I'm taking a round brush and neutral gray and we're going to apply the snow that's in our pattern in the background here. Now everybody's branches have changed, so you're just gonna add some snow on these branches. Just a little wiggled clump. It's not gonna matter if it's exactly like in the picture. It can't be because our branches are all different. So this is neutral gray. So what we're gonna do now is we want to push this into the background. So I am taking black green and a large brush again and thinning it down and I'm going to apply this nice wash over top. It's over the snow and over the branches. This is going to make them in our background. So now they're very subdued you don't see them very much. I'm gonna take a smaller brush, pick up my wash, and come in and push back any branches that I have in here. You only need the ones on this side. You don't have to worry about getting over here if you have any there. We just wanna put a little bit of this black green wash over top of these, and it's going to push this background back a little bit further. Anywhere that stands out nice and bright. We want these to be in our background, so we do that by making it distant and pushing this over top of it. So if you haven't made it dark enough, you can dry it. You can dry it and redo it again. So you want to have it nice and dark. You want this to be very 
faint in the background, we're going to be applying newer branches that are going on top and they are going to be what stands out. So you see the difference now when you look at that snow, it's very subtle, very in the background. Okie doke. Can we borrow your so I'm taking my dome stippler and I'm going to pick up my honey brown and just scuff it off on a towel. There, just adjust that. I'm going to nice and softly dry brush a highlight. Here. In the middle of my shoe. Then I go into cocoa, same dirty brush, work it in on the palette and scuff it off on your towel. And it's a little bit lighter. And softly add that highlight. Mm 